I'm so excited, everybody. I got me a PS5. I wanted to wait till the price got down low enough because I wasn't finna pay no $1,300, $1,400 for this damn PS5. But I am so excited that I got my PS5. I'm finna get on my 2K hype. If y'all wanna start seeing your boy online games, holla at your boy. I'm finna sharpen my skills up, and yeah. And now we're gonna get into some of this NBA action. Let's go. What's going on, everybody? It's your boy, Rick One Ball, coming at you again with yet another classic. We had a great night in the NBA tonight. I wanted to recap on everything that was going on. And uh, just say what's going on. You give y'all the face-to-face, -face, give you the visual. You feel me? The first game I want to get into is the Los Angeles Clippers versus the Dallas Mavericks. The stars were out tonight. You had Ezekiel Elliott. Uh, who else? Dirk Nowitzki. Of course, Mark Cuban, uh, owner of the Dallas Mavericks. And, and of course, uh, Steve Ballmer, the owner of the uh, Los Angeles Clippers. This was a great game. This was the game that the Clippers had to show up. I didn't give a damn what Paul George said in the media, talking that nonsense, talking about we ain't worried. Oh, no, nah, we ain't worried about it at all. They just made some shots, and, yeah, we're not feeling no pressure. Man, stop lying. Like Stephen A. Smith said, you've been getting your ass kicked. You was down two games to zero. So we knew this was a game you had to show up and showed up. Paul George did. Dropped 29 points, seven rebounds, four assists. This boy was out there balling. I mean, at one point in time, he had 12 or 13 shooting from the field. He couldn't be stopped. And, and, and I think it's safe to call this boy Playoff P. Let's call him. Let's respect his name now. Call him Playoff P for right now. Don't call him Pandemic P. Let's respect the man, man for right now. <laughs> now, Kawhi Leonard pitched in with 36 points, 8 rebounds, and 3 assists. And notice I said pitched in. Kawhi Leonard had a very efficient game as well. But I felt like that really, if I was going to give an MVP to somebody tonight, it was going to be Paul George. I feel like Paul George, everybody, including Kawhi Leonard, followed his lead. This man is getting tired of being called Pandemic P. He came out and balled. He came out and balled, but Kawhi Leonard, like I said, Kawhi Leonard was dropping buckets, doing what Kawhi Leonard now, the does. The player that they ain't been having no answer for all series long, already up until this point, Luka Doncic. Luka legend. Luka magic. This dude's been dropping buckets. Tonight he had 44 points, um, 9 rebounds, and, and, eight, and 9 assists. 9 rebounds and 9 assists. They can do absolutely nothing with Luka Doncic. I feel like... They're so lucky to win this game because the Mavericks were close. They start the Clippers start pulling away late, but 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 the Mavericks were close. They have nothing to hang their head about. This dude Luka Doncic and this shooting off one foot crap that he's getting away with doing. This is crazy. This is absolutely insane that this dude has that type of that type of efficiency with some of the shots that he's shooting. I mean, it's a slow, methodical, kind of law you to sleep type of game, but uh, it works. It really works. The Dallas Mavericks still lead that series two to one, so we'll we'll stay tuned and we'll we'll keep you informed on that one. Now, the next game I want to get into is the Atlanta Hawks versus the New York Knicks. This game was played inside of Atlanta. Uh, Atlanta had to answer. Uh, Trey Young came out big. They just kind of just start beating the Knicks up. At one point, he uh, uh, Trey Young pointed to one of the uh, New York Knicks teammates who was trying to give him crap and said, "Look at the score. Go ahead, go ahead, look at the score." Spike Lee, you know, he's doing his usual thing, supporting his Knicks. But uh, Atlanta Hawks had to win this game tonight. They had to win this game. I feel like the Atlanta Hawks are the better team. Uh, New York Knicks, they, they're a great team as far as like you know, especially coming from where they came from. But I feel like the the New York, I mean, the Atlanta Hawks is time. It's absolutely time. You got. You got, uh, who's got, uh, 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 Lemon Pepper Lou over there. You got Trey Young over there. You got Clint Capella over there. They got some pieces. You got, uh, uh, John Collins. I like John Collins. He got some tremendous ups and some, he plays with some big intensity. So Atlanta Hawks win this game tonight and they lead the series two to one. The last game I'm going to get into is the Brooklyn Nets versus the Boston Celtics. Boston Celtics coming to this game down two games to zero. So they know they had to come to play. The game was in Boston, East Coast, with those fans, and come to play they did because they would have ran them up out of town with the booze if Boston Celtics didn't come out with a good product tonight. Jalen, uh, not Jalen Browns, but uh, Jason Tatum dropped 50, 50 points tonight. They needed every bit of them, every bit of them with Jalen Brown being out. And uh, Jason Tatum is showing why he's a superstar. 
He was able to weather the storm. Kyrie Irving, James Harden, Kevin Durant, they came to play tonight as well. Nobody was really pulling away from each other until late, late in the game. And uh, that's when uh, Celtics kind of separated themselves. And even then, uh, uh, Brooklyn was able to make a run uh, and, and cut it down to about seven points. But Brooklyn was able to uh, hold it off and, uh, and do their thing tonight. Uh, that game, that series is uh, two to one. B- uh, Brooklyn is still leading it. So we'll keep you informed on that and let you know what's going on with that as well. I'm so excited. I got finally got me a PS5. I'm going to be starting doing some online games, y'all, some 2K. If y'all want to fuck, rock with me, I'm going to say cuss word. As always, thank you guys for rocking with your boy on this beautiful Friday night. It's your boy, Rick One Ball. Like, comment, and subscribe. My page is going crazy. My channel is going many. If you can, you guys, invite a friend. Let them know what kind of work we're doing over here at Rick One Ball Productions. Let them know, man. Holla at me. I love you guys. Peace.